Hello everybody, welcome to Cole's Place. My name's Colin, great to have you along and thanks for tuning in to another video. Um, I'm not back in the UK, I'm still in sunny Tenerife and uh, I was going to have a day off vlogging today. Uh, I wasn't going to film anything, but I thought, while I'm here, I might as well do one. Um, so yeah, uh, I'm going out. I'm uh, going to take you with me um, because I need to pick up something to fill a little piece of my life back home because that's what life is. You come a long way sometimes just for something very small for that little bit of satisfaction and that's what i'm doing today i'm going to take you guys with me but before we go i want you to have a look at this a gopro camera and a thing to fit it on your car windscreen i have spent the last half hour trying to suss this out because i've never used this bit before so i'm assuming that sticks to your windscreen that sticks to your gopro <laughs> like I say, sometimes big journey for little things, but I've sussed it, so let's go. Before we go, yes, it's 28 degrees, and yes, you can subscribe, and yes, you can give it a thumbs. Because after all, it is a vlog. Let's go. And my mate Vicky says, I'm not organised. do that when you're driving a car abroad you go to get in the wrong side <laughs> and uh, I've just got to shoot back up I forgot my power cable I thought I was organized back in a sec Okay, I've pulled over um, because I feel I should explain a little bit more. Um, I don't normally do these type of uh, vlogs, um, but I'm going to do one today. Uh, sometimes in life, you do have to go a long way just to get that little bit of self-happiness. And uh, I'm going to show you something about me in part two of the vlog when I get back to the UK that none of you knew, uh, none of you knew about. And today, uh, I'm going for that little jigsaw piece that helps me fulfill my own little sort of personal thing back home in the UK and it sort of reflects on life in general. So we're gonna leave Los Cristianos, get on a TF1. Where we're going, I've already vlogged there before, I've done like a, a touristy vlog showing you there. Um, it's a place that you know I really like going to and hopefully when I get there I'll be able to find one of them little jigsaw pieces. Okay so uh, yeah join me let's have an afternoon out.
you know where we are? <laughs> We're in El Medano. A little bit off the beaten track, not a massive uh, tourist spot, but two reasons why I've come here today. Oh, and by the way, look, I've bought my gimbal, but I'm not even using it. I'm breaking all the conventions of vlogging. <laughs> oh, hang on, look at this. Bournemouth people, why did that remind me of Studland Bay? Anyway, uh, yeah, two reasons to come here today. Uh, one, when I come to Tenerife, this is fast becoming one of my happy places. And uh, two, bit of a journey. You saw me struggling to get out of Los Cristianos. Not exactly on the doorstep. Uh, but I've come here because I want that little jigsaw piece which will come clear in part two of the vlog back in the UK. So keep watching. I'm hoping the jigsaw piece is findable here today. I found one last time I came and uh, hopefully I'll get one today. There's a saying, big effort, little reward. That's used negatively, I think. Making a big effort today, just for that little reward, for that little reward makes me so happy so it's worth it right let's get into the town Using me gimbal now because uh, I kept slipping and sliding and tripping over that crazy paving that is a bit shaky, so I'm using me gimbal. What I'm looking for is normally here. Was last time. Ah, I found my little pot of gold. There we go. See you in a minute. That's it. Stone, it's olivina from Lanzarote. It's a very good stone. If you want to look in internet yep. about the property, yep. it's 
from the, the lava, you know? Like in the interior of the lava, when you break a lava storm, in yeah. the interior of the lava, the olivina is making when the cold water and the hot lava... Uh, when the lava is creating, yeah. Yeah. the olivina is in the center. Like when you break, you can break a very big stone of lava. And it's in the center? Yes, yes. That's beautiful. It's like the heart, or the heart of the lava storm. Yeah, yeah. I'll give it, I have a daughter. Yeah, you can make shower. This, yeah. this one is special. The material yeah. is uh, free nickel. Yeah. From the uh, anti allergic, from people she has, you know, problem with the metal. Yeah, yeah, beautiful. Really good, really good. Thank you so much. Thank You're you. Welcome. <laughs> Vic is right, I'm not organised. All this way, I didn't get cash out of the cash point. Makes it a bigger effort. I bet you all thought I was going to show you my pin number. <laughs> Absolutely stunning here. even happier soon that'll be in part two back in the UK I feel a bit bad because uh, me not being organized I forgot they only take cash and bless them they were about to finish when I turned up they were packed away but they waited till I went to cash point and uh, just had a little chat with them actually I'm not that disorganized I did message them on Instagram to see if they were here and uh, yeah, they were here and I've just about caught them in time. <laughs> Let's get back to the car. Do you know what? I'm that unorganised. Come all the way here and uh, forgot about having lunch. Check it out. Be a bit rude if I didn't try this place out and grab something to eat. I am hungry. <laughs> Okay, had my lunch, I'm back at the car now. Just show you this again. Absolutely stunning. And it brought back a memory. When I was a kid, I never lived near the sea. I'm lucky enough now to live near the sea. I live in Bournemouth, as most of you know. Um, but the wind is on shore, it's coming in. And the smell of that, absolutely beautiful. The smell of the sea, it's fresh. And it reminds me of when we were kids. Uh, I didn't live near the sea, I lived in Chester uh, and as kids, my mum and dad now and again, they take us into North Wales for a day out and not living near the sea then, when you go near the sea, you can smell it, if that makes sense and for the first time in years, I've just smelt that smell beautiful what a great beach so I'm back at the car oh Put it the right way up. Got me a little jigsaw piece. So stick around for part two, which will be filmed about two and a half thousand miles and a four hour flight away back home in sunny, sunny Bournemouth. See you then.